Early predictions for the 2024 hurricane season in the Atlantic Basin are for an extremely active period. That increases the probability that this year Belize could be hit. While the National Med Service reiterates its advice for everyone to be prepared and update their hurricane and preparedness plan, Chief Meteorologist Ronald Gordon on Monday told the press that they are prepared te technology-wise. Well, currently, of course, we have various tools at our disposal. Um, you mentioned the radar. Of course, that's working. That's up and running for the past, I would say, uh, two to three years. So we haven't had much interruption in terms of that particular instrument. And we are, of course, uh, working very closely to ensure that it's um, serviced and operating for this hurricane season that is coming up in, on June the 1st. So um, that tool is there. And of course, there are various other tools at our disposal, including, of course, the forecast models. We um, have our network of automatic weather stations. Uh, we have different systems like our lightning detection system and so forth that we all combine, we use combinedly to, um, to issue these forecasts. And of course, we have our very good and reliable agency um, up north that is tasked by the World Meteorological Organization to provide that type of um, support to this region which is the National Hurricane Center. So, of course, we will rely on them to fly into these systems and give us precisely the location and the track of these systems so that we can adequately prepare at the local level. Gordon also recommended that those who can afford it consider hurricane insurance. If you are able to afford insurance, now is a good time to look at it because the prediction is going for an active season. And like I mentioned before, that means that there's a higher risk of one coming our way. So if you can afford insurance, that's a good thing to look at at the moment as well. And that type of thing, no, to ensure that you are prepared for the, um, the event that something comes your way. Now, in terms of any particular location across the country, um, we do know that our entire coastline is vulnerable to hurricanes. Um, there is no doubt about it. Uh, however, of course, if you're way down south, I believe maybe south of Punta Gorda and below, um, it has been rare that you get a direct landfall. Um, we do know that you have secondary effects from systems making landfall in Central America, which includes excess, excessive rainfall. So to, to, I guess to summarize, there is no particular location on the coast of Belize that is um, exempt. It is important that all communities that are directly um, in the part of these systems prepare in advance and take measures to, um, to mitigate uh, any possible negative impact no, from, um, from hurricanes or from an possible and falling system this season. 